Well, folks, I think this geoengineering stuff isn't working. Today is February 15th, 2014, and we have a storm coming into the west coast here of California that should be, should be diving down to Southern California, but it's breaking apart. It shouldn't be breaking apart. Um, this right here shows the upper level winds. We've got a little low spinning here with a little convergence here. Some converging uh, happen here. Uh, we can go to where all the weather hangs out at 250 and uh, so you can see that the air is squashed together here low and it is coming in like a gangbuster here today I mean this is today's path for the main weather makers for the wind and we can go with uh, you know precipitation too um, and here's some precip, but it's not making it to us. Okay, so what I think is happening here is the geoengineering that they're doing is making a mess out of the storms that are coming in to our direction. Literally making a giant effect and I'll show you here right now as you can see the chemtrails here being sprayed this is a 48 hour loop same site different inverse photo and it's falling apart as you can see right here another one right here shows falling apart visible range just falling apart beautiful storm coming to the west coast falling apart this one shows a storm that has very good potential but as you can see as it gets closer and you can see all these little chemtrails here on this one just not is not as good all these little chemtrails underneath this thing is just I think is making this in my personal humble opinion is making this thing fall apart if you really want to get a good shot of the chemtrails well here you go they're all right there and as they clouds come over the chemtrails right here all of a sudden they turn into pea soup and they just start coming down into these wafts of nothingness. So in the face of a drought right now, right here, they're causing a drought, I believe, because they just knocked the crap out of this storm right here with, with, this, with this batch of chemtrail, I believe. Because why did it just fan out like that and just disappear? In my opinion. Just wanted to give a quick vid out. Eyes up and pay attention out there because Fukushima is going to be with us for quite some time and we need to stay out of the ocean and protect ourselves and our families and our next generations we need to get rid of all nuclear too so that's really more important than all this chemtrail crap but we need rain uh, everything can be put aside until Fukushima is fixed and the nuclear thing is fixed and all the lies are fixed when we start admitting the lies and stop perpetuating the lies every year at all these 9-11 you know memorial memorials and all this other stuff you know John F Kennedy Memorial every year you know it's like you know 
let's bring out the truths and and start fresh and start over guys okay peace love granola have a great day god bless